Hi everyone, it's Sonia again, and welcome back to my channel. Um, I wanted to do a quick video for you guys today. Um, I actually had a request from a subscriber, so um, if you guys aren't subscribed to my channel, please consider uh, subscribing. I appreciate all the comments and all the love um, and the feedback that I've been getting. So anyways, I wanted to come back. I actually had a, um, a subscriber ask for a video on how I tied my um, bandeau on my pochette Matisse. So here's my pochette Matisse here in the background. And you can see I took off the um, bandeau that I had on there. And what I wanted to do was, I definitely want to film that video for you guys, but I was talking to my sister the other day and I was showing her my bandeau and I noticed that I had already a couple of little like spots on it. Um, and so that kind of bothered me. So she said, well, why don't you stain treat your, um, your bandeau? She said, it's, it's a silk scarf, right? And I said, yeah, that's what it is. And she was so, we talked a little bit more about it, and so anyways, I decided, and I looked into it, and the same stuff that I had uh, used to treat my leather, the Baquetta leather on my bags, this Apple brand uh, Guard, um, Rain and Stain Repellent, um, I actually read into it, and it does cover fabrics, including silk. So I am going to try this today. I went ahead and I already um, got my uh, scarf um, dry cleaned. So they took out those spots that were in there. And so anyways, I'm going to show you, um, basically I put it back in the bag in the box that it came in. So it's not an unboxing since you have already seen it, but I kind of just wanted for those of you that um, have never purchased one before, kind of the cute um, packaging that it comes in. So this is it's this really long, narrow um, bag that it comes in. And I'll go ahead and pull it out of the box. So this is the box here. And here's the proof of purchase. So I actually um, picked this up at Crystal's um, in the um, the Crystal shop in Las Vegas, Nevada. And my uh, essay there, her name was Jennifer, and she was just awesome. She took the extra time to even uh, show me how to tie the bandeau on the handle. So uh, thank you, shout out to Jennifer over at Crystal Shops. Thank you so much. I've been enjoying this um, bandeau so much. So anyways, here's the pretty little. Uh, drawer box that it came in and so mine actually did not come with a dust bag but instead just came in this you know the typical tissue paper wrapping so I'll go ahead and open it for you guys so this is it and you guys probably noticed the new background um, I'm kind of still trying to figure out um, where um, it works best to kind of film in my house so now I'm in my bedroom <laughs> so Hopefully you guys like this view a little bit more than my uh, dining room. But anyways, so this is the bandeau that I selected. Um, it's this beautiful, I believe it's the trunks and bags uh, bandeau and it came in this beautiful, gorgeous um, pink. So I'll go ahead and show you guys kind of the contrast here. And then on one, on the other side where it has the pink, it says Louis Vuitton on it. So. Beautiful. Um, so I'm going to give it a shot. So let's um, go ahead and I'm going to have like a little box uh, covered with like a little black thing here. And so I'm not sure if you guys are going to be able to see this. So what I may need to do is kind of tilt the camera down so you guys get a better view of what I am doing here. Um, but I guess I could try doing this one-handed. Let's see what happens. Or I could grab a pillow from my bed. <laughs> Sorry guys, I should have been more prepared to do this. So let's see. I'm going to grab the apple guard and I am going to spray this. Oh, fingers crossed this doesn't mess up my bando. <laughs> I'm a little nervous. All right, here we go guys. Now, pull it a little bit more. So far, so good. I don't see any discoloration. Okay, last bit here. Okay. And now I'm going to go ahead and flip it over and spray the other side of it as well. So here we go. And I'm holding it like about six inches above the bandeau, as you guys can see. There we go. And the last 
section here. All right, so, so far um, I don't see any discoloration. It is a little damp, um, but that's to be expected. And so according to the bottle here on uh, the Apple Guard, what it says is to allow the um, fabric to dry for 30 minutes. So that's what I'm going to plan to do. I'm going to let this dry really well and then I will come back with another video on um, how I actually wrap this on the handle of my push at Matisse um, and so you guys can see how I did that. Um, so again, thank you guys for joining me. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel and I will see you guys very soon for another video on how I tie this bad boy on my pochette Matisse. And uh, thanks again. Bye.